Roberta Williams' life is one of fascination. Married to the notorious underworld figure Carl Williams, Roberta witnessed and experienced the Melbourne gangland war to its full extent and managed to live to tell her story, the real underbelly. than anyone thinks. That was an emotional visit. I had a little cry and a little laugh. I felt really sad when I left there. Australia thinks it knows me and the men in my life, but it doesn't. He actually wrote in the... He signed a book out and, um... Wrote a part in there. Um, oh, can I grab that book? Um, it's not a bad. It's about the gangland war. It's not a bad read, but it's far from the truth. However, I expect nothing less from John Sylvester. After all, he is pro-police, and the last thing the police want the public to know is the truth. Because if they did, maybe they'd think of me as some sort of hero which is quite true in some sense. When people say or you hear the word kill or be killed, I can relate to that because that was what was happening. Andrew um, actually told Carl that um, Judy Moran had given him a contract to murder Carl and I, and um, that him and another person had actually hidden in our roof for three days waiting for the opportunity to get Carl and I. And um, Andrew later on said that um, he couldn't hurt me because he heard me in the night rocking my baby to sleep. Murder wasn't always familiar to me, but I knew how to struggle and fight from an early age. Mum had seven kids under 12 when Dad died. I suppose I'm not taking the blame for us or her. But um, life would have been tough on a 30, 29 year old woman, seven kids under 12. My mum one day um, obviously had one of her tantrums. I think I was only really young, probably eight years, seven, eight years old. And um, she grabbed a bottle of nail polish remover and was gonna pour it in my eyes, she said. I was sort of out and about roaming the streets from 11 years old. I actually used to shoplift my own clothing at eight years old. People can judge and criticise and whatever, but the real truth is still to be told, so maybe one day. You've only heard the police version of Melbourne's Underworld, which was my life. A lot of it's fiction. I'll tell you the truth, the whole truth, and nothing but the truth. That I swear.